hey guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel it's tashinga here if you're new to the channel welcome welcome and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back thank you so much i appreciate you thank you for coming back thank you for watching my content for sharing if you have shared before and if you're planning to share this one um i haven't done this in a long time this is going to be a really quick video i was just thinking to myself and i was like you know i was thinking a lot about how things are going in my life how i'm anxious sometimes how i'm you know i want to get the results so quick i want to know what's happening everything like is not making sense you know and like you want results you want to know what you're gonna do next you want to know what's happening next you want to know your next step and you just want things to work out you know you just want life to to be lifing <laughs> so um, and i was just thinking to myself and i realized that you know we do not reap the seeds the day uh oh i just chugged we do not reap the fruit the day we plant the seed there is a process behind i think uh we talked about this way before we were, yeah. so we do not get the fruit from a tree or from a garden the day we plant the seed there is uh waiting there is a process there are processes and let's say or oh, we are using a garden for uh as an analogy we wait we we water the garden we you know we weed we 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 make sure that the environment for the crop that we just planted is conducive for growth for us to expect a harvest so i was just thinking like okay tashinga you might be confused so and so you might like want things to be happening in the now like right now i want the results right now i want more subscribers right now i want to get the job right now i want to advance in life right now but then why don't we uh treat ourselves as that plant that seed that okay i've been planted now i need to do everything that is going to ensure that my environment is very conducive to get the result that i want if you are um a youtuber then what are the things that you are doing to ensure that you get the fruit out of the seed that you've planted if you are you you want to be an entrepreneur in the future are you doing the research if you want to start a kindergarten if you want to do this what are you doing in the now that is going to ensure that you get the result that you want to see so i was just in the gut like i was just like i was the least motivated person maybe i still am but then this is a reminder to you and to me that it's a process we do not get fruit the same day we plant the seed it happens as we go a step at a time every step of the way you constantly remind yourself of your why that okay i started this youtube channel because of so and so and so so what am i doing to ensure that i reap from this seed that I've planted. What are you doing to ensure that you get those A's, you get that first class degree? Are you studying? Are you doing the things that are required to do the things that you're supposed to do? Sometimes we we get so frustrated also because we're looking at person B like, okay, they are making it big. They're, they're in a different lane, honey. They are in a different lane. The same way I, uh, I think some weeks back, I was telling uh, some of my friends that, you know, uh, it's so easy to compare ourselves to the next person but then we do not realize how much harm that is causing to us because that person is running their own race now you are running a race that is not yours you might end you might be efficient in that lane but then you get there that's not where you're supposed to be so what's the win what's the win what's the win <laughs> what's the catch so it's very important to know that it's a process and in this process we, we we make we be true to ourselves let's be true to ourselves i mean i do not know how to express this enough i could cry <laughs> i'm not gonna cry on the internet okay <laughs> but yeah that is basically what i'm saying because um I, I was giving them an example of um a lion and a cow that a lion um feeds on prey they have to hunt and then they catch maybe a buffalo and they eat but um 
a cow grazes on grass right and the cow chews the cud so if i'm a lion and i'm looking at her cow chewing the cud and i'm just there you know flexing like the cow i do not chew the cud i need to stand and go work to go feed but this guy can graze and later on he's chewing and you'll be like ah i'm gonna chill like the cow dude you die of hunger you will die <laughs> you will be hungry because you are different from person B and person A and the likes and everything. So I am reminding you that, you know, God hasn't forgotten you. He will never forget you. And um, the scripture for today is a scripture that we all know. Philippians 1, 6. That he, um, uh, being sure of this thing. Let me open. Uh, being confident of this very thing that he which hath begun a good work in you will perform it until the day of Jesus Christ. I got a new Bible, by the way. So keep it in. Do what you need to do to get where you're supposed to get to in line with your destiny, in line with the things that you need to do, expertise, excellence. Do not go to bed without doing something that is going to aid the person that you have initially been called to be. And... I just hope I say the English well. <laughs> but yeah, do not, like, it's a process. And trust the process and trust God. He's got your back 24-7. He would never leave you. He's more invested in your success than you. Okay? So remember that. And yeah, this is a wrap, guys. My phone is acting up. I think it's storage issues and the likes. But yeah, to my next one, do show some grace to yourselves. I love you and I appreciate you so, so much. Sending love and light.